Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be over my everyday makeup routine. I got a lot of requests to do this video, so I really, really hope you guys like it. And if you have not done so already, make sure you subscribe. And I'm going to go ahead and jump us straight into this video now. So I went ahead and already did my brows off camera. And I went ahead, before I do my brows, I always prime, prep and prime my face with these e.l.f. products. This is the hydrating serum, and this is the prep and hydrate balm. I really love these two products together because they really just bring the moisture back into my face after I've washed it. Um, if I sound a little weird today, it's because I'm not feeling that well. My throat hurts a little bit, so yeah, just bear with me. Okay, so currently for foundation, I've been loving the Sephora. This is the 10 Hour Wear Perfection Foundation mixed with the L'Oreal True Match and C10. Um, I really like the consistency and the formula of the Sephora foundation. I use it as my base. It has the red undertones, but they're not overpowering. So I just mix it with the C10 and it kind of creates the perfect match for my foundation that I like. Okay, now that we've gotten all that matched up perfectly, um, this foundation mix usually gives me a really good match to my chest, and that's why I am obsessed with it. Next, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move on to my eyes. I typically don't wear eyeshadow on a daily basis, but if I do do my eyeshadow, this is how I like to do it. So I start by um, priming my eyelids with a concealer, and this is the Ellie Girl Concealer in Dark Cocoa. I'm just gonna go ahead and set that. And this, the powder I'm using to set it right now is the Airspun, the translucent powder. So for eyeshadow, I usually like to just stick with something matte um, for an everyday makeup look. So I'm going to be using this eyeshadow palette here. And I'll have it linked down below. I don't know why I'm forgetting the name of it right now, but I'll have that linked down below. And um, to be honest, like I said, I don't normally wear eyeshadow on a daily basis, but if I do wear it, I've kept my routine very simple. Like I usually probably just use like three colors. So I'm going to use this one here and this one here is a transition shade. Next I'm using this chocolate color here and this color here and I'm just using that in my crease just to make it a little bit more slopey. Alright, and to be honest that's usually it. <laughs> that's all I like to do for my eyeshadow. Um, I just, I really just prefer to keep it super simple when it comes to my eyes. For eyeliner I'm using the L'Oreal Infallible Lacquer Liner in the shade Black is Black. And I've honestly just gotten to a point where I just do a wing eye, like for almost every look. And for mascara, I'm just using this Black Up Revulsion Mascara. I'm going to go ahead and highlight my brow bone using this e.l.f. I use this side of it. This is one of my favorite highlighters. This is the Baked Highlighter and Bronzer. Um, for my under eye concealer, I have a little bit of that foundation mix that I had earlier. And I'm just mixing that with the LA Girl Pro Conceal in Dark Cocoa. If I can get any of it to come out. Almost out. Next, I'm just gonna set everything with the RCMA Loose Setting Powder. This is the No Color Powder. And I just like to start underneath my eyes with a smaller, more precise brush. So I just make sure that I get some product in there and it doesn't crease. And then I just take a bigger brush to set everything else. So now for contour, um, it just depends on if I'm in a hurry or not. If I'm not in a hurry, I'll use the Ben Nye Beard Stipple and I'll go ahead and do the process and everything and blending it out and all that good stuff. If I am in a hurry, um, I just throw on the powder contour that I like to use. This is the Amuse Smoky Eyes in Deep Dust. Um, this morning I am in a hurry, so I'm going to go ahead and just use this. <laughs>
For blush, I'm using this e.l.f. Sorry, it has fingerprints all over that mirror. I'm using this e.l.f. blush palette. Um, I'm using these, this shade right here and this shade right here. some mascara I'm gonna go ahead and set the rest of my face with that no color powder I'm gonna use that same highlighter that I used earlier to highlight my brow bone to go ahead and highlight the rest of my face So I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face down and then put on my lashes. I find that when if I spray, if I put on my lashes first and then spray my face down, they tend to lift a little bit more, so I just like to spray it first. Lashes I'm gonna be using today, are, that I use every day mainly, are the Casina lashes. And these are in the style number 415. I really, really love these lashes. They're super light and um, they also have a little bit more length to them. So they give me a little bit more drama than uh, the normal Demi Wispies. So while I'm waiting for my lashes to dry, I'm just going to add a little bit more highlight. So this is the lip combo that I had on in my top five contours for dark skin. So um, I just use any normal brown eyeliner. I think this is the Wet n Wild Coal Colors. I don't even know, but it's brown. So I just use a brown lip liner. This is a MAC lipstick in the shade Double Shot. rose and I'm just using it as the topper to make it a little bit more glossy and shiny and then also to just blend everything together I do lo love a good matte lipstick but this is by far my favorite lip combo so this is the final look. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Lots of love and I'll see you guys next time.